Stevlin Nangas Appreciation Society. It is what it says in the name, really. We're uh, yeah, a crack team. When you're 17, you should go in after girls, playing football down the park with your mates. When we were 17, we created an appreciation society for a low league footballer that no one had ever heard of called Stevlin Angus. Girls didn't come into it for us, it was, it was just Stevlin, Stevlin, Stevlin. We were in maths talking about football manager. I was looking for an elite to write back. Matt was talking about a couple of guys that he signed from Cambridge United, one of whom was Stevlin Angus. So we had meetings to talk about sort of how good Stevland was. A lot of our time was spent playing football, trying to emulate Stevland. The games did tend to be a bit boring as we all wanted to play in defence. What position you want to play? Right back, just not Stev. No, I'm playing right back. Hey, I'm right back. I'm always the right back. Hey, you were right back. So, a lot of nil-nil draws. We made several things for Stevland, mainly badges. We all have badges. He had a badge, we had spare badges. We decided to find out if he was actually any good in real life. He was still at Cambridge at the time. We requested that we could meet our hero, we could interview him, we could uh, hand over some Appreciation Society badges. The whole room sort of changed when he walked into it. Very much brought an atmosphere of joy and, you know, you could tell that people were feeding off that. Meeting Stev was the best moment of all of our lives. Sadly, it came to an end, but the legacy of the club lives on. I wish I could still sign him on Football Manager. I wish he was still playing. So today, 13 years after the greatest day of our life, we've travelled all the way down to watch Cambridge United versus Exeter in a League Two game. To meet Stelvin again, to see how he's doing, tell him about the club and see what else he's got to teach us. He was just one of those players that was just a bit of a dream to have in football manager, he was really dependable. So tell me a bit more about the, the club. Well, we signed John for football manager. We met Stelvin as immature, inexperienced teenagers and uh, he very much guided us on the path, I would say, from youthhood to manhood. The Stevlin Appreciation Society is open up to all. We want more people to join, to experience the pleasure you get from following him and from living your life by his mantras. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Stev, what do you make them? To be honest, I don't really remember them. But I didn't really want to let them down, so uh, I thought I'd turn up anyway. 